fresh off work, he talking about. Fresh off work, like a jerk, watch him twerk, smoking per eight. Hey, nah. <laughs> Boy, what's happening? What it is? What's going on? Everybody out there in the YouTubes. It's your boy Mike Rich. Hope everybody, each and every last one of y'all is having a blessed, blessed day today. Shout out today. Some shoes drop. Hey, some nines or something drop. Anyway, it's night vlog time. We're going to go in the athlete's foot. Can y'all see it over there? In the horizon. You feel me? We're going to go to TJ Maxx. See that TJ Maxx over there? Ever since Jay found that uh, Mitchell and Ned jersey and TJ Matt made want to go and see if they had anything. It went on this side of town, but uh, they made want to go in there. Somebody might get a Georgia hoodie or something. Go dogs, you feel me? And then I'm going to go down to Hibbert Sports, you feel me? So, um, like I said, a shoe drop today. Shoe a track can water. I don't know if they're going to have it in here because for some reason, this athlete's foot be getting everything late. Maybe I might get lucky, lucky and see a pair of... Um, Cherry limbs or lost the founds. I doubt it. But anyway, anyway, uh, how y'all doing, man? I hope everybody having a good one. You know what I'm saying? Y'all see the red keep flashing in my face? That's that's what red flag look like. Um, that's like the visual uh, of a red flag. But <laughs> your boy Richard red flag. Anyway, man, get out of the car, man. Turn it off. Happy holidays to everybody. Merry Christmas to everybody. Hope y'all having a good one. Good holiday. Uh, like I said, athletes foot crazy having a kid's birthday so close to holiday my my daughter's birthday is uh on the 15th of december and then christmas on the 25th so you know they just be wanting all my money let's see what they got here i, I have a very strange suspicion that they ain't got jack in this athlete's foot <laughs> let's see Rich Nation, my um, suspicions were accurate because it's trash can water in here. I think some nines dropped. I don't see them, though. So the nines did not even come to this store. But if they did, I'm pretty sure they would be sitting. They have these Air Force Ones, though. What's up with the colors on these Air Force Ones? These ain't bad. La Mocha and Cream. You know what I'm saying? Hey, you talking about? Got UNC uh, questions in here. I'm surprised that these like the Denver Nuggets guys, I guess. But I'm surprised that they ain't, they ain't put suede on that toe. That would look better because this little leather, it looks really, really dry. I don't know. They don't sell already, though. They're my first time seeing them in this style. <laughs> yeah, so that was an L. You feel me? L's come in many forms. That was one of them. There wasn't nothing in there, Shawty. I was all excited. Let me walk to TJ Mack while I'm over here. If that athlete's foot in there, I don't know what the hell made me think TJ Mack gonna have some. <laughs> or Hibbit. I'm still gonna vlog it, though. I'm the vlogger. Hey, you talking about? They just vlog everything. TJ Maxx. I don't know why I'm expecting to see anything around the holiday times, but here we are. TJ Maxx. Y'all remember that commercial? Comment below. Ah, damn, boy, it's a whole bunch of BS in here, man. Lots of it. Let me tell you something like this. If you want a headache, come to Burlington's, TJ Maxx, place like this, and go through these racks trying to find something hard. You're going to get a headache, my boy. If I can hit it, all right. Ain't my side, though. Small. Or styling with the guest guy. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, nah. Criminal sweater head All right, they found gonna hit it hard. They want twenty five dollars for that guy. Original price eighty five dollar. Look at that little. Eee. Ain't got my side though. All right, I was trying to find that Falcon hoodie in my side. Oh, wait a minute. Hit it. Nope, that's a large. I think Lisa is a large, bro. Ding ding ding, extra large. Twenty four ninety nine. Yes, sir, ski. I like it. I like it, man. It's like the little knits. It ain't gonna make my team no better, but you know what I'm saying? But it's very comfortable. At $25, you can't beat it, man. But I've achieved the headache. Headache unlocked while looking for it. Damn it. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> was that two L's in a row? They ain't had no shoes or nothing, man. I ain't even look at the shoe section, honestly. I was like, TJ, Matt, from these slim pickings in here, the shoes can't be can't be hitting on nothing. I did get that Falcons uh Falcons hitting. Got it. You feel me? Um good materials. You feel me? I'm reviewing it. Good materials. Nice thick warm materials. Uh good stitching, good quality on the hoodie. I'm feeling it. You know what I'm saying? 
Anyway, let's see what he was got down the road. Y'all, last try. Last try. See, I can't get to the mall on time because they close in like three minutes. Eight o'clock. I don't know why they ain't go back to regular hours at Stone Crab, but uh, Hibbit don't close at nine. So let's see what they got going on. Yes, yeah, sir, Ski. At least I get to see the shoe that dropped today. This was the reason for the video. They got, well, they got a little restart. These some kids. That's a four Y in the forest. I didn't need these. I got cements, man. I ain't need these guy right here. Clean though. Clean. Super clean. But I didn't need them. You feel me? And this is what dropped today. <laughs> Oof. D trap, bro. Now, first of all, disclaimer, I'm not a fan of nines like that. I want olive nines and that's it. Just give me a pair of olive nines. And that's the only nine I have in my collection forever. And these ain't quite trap, but I'm saying. Had a cool gray against the white. I mean, with the red heads. I mean, what are we doing with these for real? I mean, y'all come tell me what y'all think. I can't give y'all a non-biased opinion because I don't like nines. And I hate cool gray. And this looks like. They just got cool gray vibes. Like the cool gray nines like this. They got the two-tone gray and the pan leather. I hate them too. That's just my opinion though, man. But like I said, not quite trash can water. It's just one of them drops you ain't got to have like that. Comment below if anybody went and caught the nine. What's the name of these? Can't even remember the name of them. I don't know. I'll look up the name after this. But uh, anybody caught these today, man, let me know. It'd be the only place I went. So I'm thinking they still sitting. Sneakers app had like two or three sizes left. And they might be sold out too. I don't know. I ain't checked sneakers in a minute. But it's holiday season. People buying up sneakers. For some reason, Jordan 7s sit regardless. But these nines still still out. Mm. True Red. I think I still got the name wrong. Was it True Red? I just looked at it. Anyway. <laughs> Did y'all get them, man? Let me know. What was it? Was it say True Red? Let me hold up. Fire Red. It don't look like Fire Red to me. I don't know. Y'all be good. The Falcon had it vibes. I know I'm showing y'all a lot of Falcon stuff, but it say ATL on the little sad. A ribbon, or whatever you call it. I say it's sad. That's yeah, right. Logo on the back. NFL. What's it? New Era? New Era guy. I love the way New Era had fit, man. The shape of New Era. New Era got the best shape, bro. Better than Mitchell and this. Better than uh, uh, 47. 47 make the best dad hats, but New Era got the best fitteds and snaps, bro. Especially as far as the fit is concerned. The Pro Bowl. 1994. I made the Pro Bowl in 1994 for the Falcons. That's a trivia question. He ain't talking about. Hey, Blue Jay guy. What? It's yeah, hard though. But not the flame and hat guy. Not the flame and hat guy. Cheeto hat wearing that. For $20. Y'all can keep it. Well, I'm bringing jeans short back, bro. I'm bringing jeans short back, boy. Like John Cena. You don't want it. You don't want no smoke with it. Drip. I guarantee it's gonna come back. Why? Somebody gonna somebody famous gonna do it. Y'all gonna be back rocking them joints, man. Bro, how much I gotta pay for them to stop making me right here, bro? I did a whole section in one of my videos talking about all the colorway they made to be. How much I gotta pay for them to stop? It colorway hard though. I ain't gonna count. Like, to make a Jordan 12? I mean that's a that's part of a 12, but it make a whole Jordan 12 or six or seven or eight or <laughs> 12 again just make a whole jordan with that color i love that maroon though or jordan 12 with that maroon Shh, that'd be hard but these track can water right here stop making these these is legit track can water hey time out somebody uncle somebody uncle gonna rock them though i ain't at the, at the, at the cookout I'm gonna shine on y'all here you talking about the kids, you know, they're gonna have a leftover drip for the for the cheerings, you feel me? Carnal guys, taxis. They still got these in men's size at the mall though. But yeah, the kids got everything, but boy. Come on, y'all. It makes sense though, cause you buy these kids be growing out these shoes so fast, man. I wouldn't I wouldn't be buying none of this either. Not for the cheerings. And they rough on shoes. Only times you buy your kids stuff like this, they doing a photo shoot or something. I don't know. Come and let me know. Hard, right, boy. Sean Kemp guy, slam cover magazine. But I'm sorry, I ain't gonna be, I ain't gonna be rocking the Kemp's with it. I'm gonna have to throw on a uh, Seattle Tens or something like that. 
Yeah, like that, that. I like the AI slam cover too. That hard. Mitchell and that guy. Yeah, I like it. Who's afraid of Allen Iverson? What to say? Chris Webber, Isaiah Ryder. I don't know. Say other stuff about them. And then he got the championship. Bulls action. Pretty clean. I mean, you gotta do it for Jordan, but at this point, I ain't finna keep repping the uh, Chicago Bulls championship like that. <laughs> we need the championships in Atlanta, man. Speaking of championships, I wouldn't wear this, but you know, doubts go doubts. Boy, what in the hell is these right here? So I can barely get them out of the rack. They were holding on to the rack, boy. What is it? Boy, what the ear convert? Boy. That ain't prismatic stumpers. What you talking about? That oil painting stumpers. Oof. These are some Chuck Taylors, boy. Oof. Massive. Massive. And the ladies must didn't like these, bro. I be seeing these things sitting all over the place. And the ladies didn't like, like y'all three they gave y'all the gold hits. Y'all weren't feeling them? Or you weren't feeling that 200 for them? Tell me what's happening with it. But y'all got the fur installation, teddy bear inside. He talking about teddy rug spin, polar bear, koala. What's out of jaw one low? Hey, ain't these the um? Ain't these the uh slide that they bit off of Yeezy that Adidas made? They look like it. And then they gonna say the brand with three strike. <laughs> but this look like uh, this look like an algorithm. <laughs> this look 3D printed for real though, like. Three who flip mode did they use the 3D print these? That what these look like. I'm saying, don't look like the algorithm though. <laughs> what y'all think of them Bain Kanye's designs? I mean, it's gonna get worse from him. Dang, this is boy, this looks crazy. Look, this look blurry. I ain't never looked at something with my own eyes and couldn't focus on it. They look blurry on the bottom. That ain't a camera shot. It just actually look blurry. That's crazy. <laughs> what are they doing? And then they got the white ones. Got the white ones too. What a price, what's the retail on something like this, bro? I don't know. Camera getting confused, why? Can't be no more than like $70, I don't know. I don't see the retail. But the NMD has evolved, bro. Like, these actually ain't that bad looking. But the NMD has, the NMD got laces now? That we doing? I could've swear NMDs didn't have laces. Is that just me? I heard they always had laces. They might have always had laces, I don't know. Well, I guess they have, because here's a regular pair of NMD right now. So, have they always had laces? I guess. For some reason, I thought they had laces. I'm tripping. They go, y'all, Addy Phones right now. Addy Phones. Yeah! Yes, yeah, Sirski, that thing fit quite nicely. You know what I'm saying? Woo! The Falcons hoodie guy worked out. You couldn't beat the price. I love the cuffs right there. Got that vintage kind of vibe going on with the cuffs. Official NFL uh, apparel or whatever this guy is. Very good stitched. You know what I'm saying? Action going on. Very comfortable. It fit perfect. You know what I'm saying? Extra large guy. Had to do it. $85 hoodie for $24.99. You feel me? Still of the century. Still of the year. Or maybe just it's the still of the day when I got the guy. You feel me? Come up real quick ski you know what i'm saying but anyway i was riding um home and i thought about a couple of things i said in this video number one being i wanted to check out my seattle tens because when i was leaving i was like man maybe i might come back and get that slam cover magazine with sean kemp on the cover come back and get that thing you know what i'm saying so went to check out my seattle tens and realized well, bell kind of went off in my head when I got home and I didn't see the Seattle Tens. I said, I sold them. They gone. They up out of here. On one of them big shoe sales I did, I let the Seattle Tens go. And then, cooler heads prevailed and I was like, you know what? Let me go in there and catch it for resale. Um, man, I pay about $250, 280 for a pair. Don't nobody care about Tens like that. No, I looked on GOAT and them things was like $385 in a size 12. I was like, boy, them Seattle 10s ain't coming back no time soon. And I was like, that ain't nobody even care about 10s like that. But they still want almost $400, probably because a lot of people didn't keep them to sell. A lot of people who bought that shoe probably rocked it. You know what I'm saying? They didn't get it to sit on and do resale. So it's probably a few pairs out there for sale. But 
Don't like I'm gonna get Seattle 10 no time soon unless one of y'all hit me up and be like, Rich, I got a side twenty need a Seattle 10 dog. You feel me? So I'm not going back to get the Sean Kemp shirt because I ain't got my Seattle tens and I don't want to wear uh Rain Man's. Uh, I don't want to wear the Reebok guys. I, 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 kamikaze they used to call them. Um But uh other thing I was thinking about was I was talking about jean shorts. Now Jean shorts used to be the move. You know what I'm saying? And I was saying like all it takes is it's gonna take a celebrity to bring them back. But you do have a celebrity that a lot of people follow, especially when it comes to hype culture and streetwear and fashion and all that stuff. And he goes by the name of Travis Scott. Yes, sir. Check some of Travis Scott fits out. He does rock super starched uh <laughs> carpenter jean shorts and Travis Travis Scott, it, it never caught on. Even Travis Scott couldn't bring back the jeans short. Like, when you talk about jeans shorts, though, sometimes you, you think of the, the the shorts that used to be pants that got cut off and got the strings hanging, and they hang below the knees, kind of like what John Cena be rocking, that kind of jean short, look like a, a redneck short or whatever. Or you got the, like, carpenter, super ironed out, straight pant jean short I, uh, that Travis Scott be wearing. But I think the last pair of jean shorts I rocked, well, the last pair of denim shorts I rocked, it had, like, it was super distressed and, like, bleached and all that stuff. And they actually look kind of dope. I ain't seen them in a while. I don't know what happened to them. Maybe my wife threw them away. Who knows? But, uh, <laughs> he talking about it. But, um, yeah, jean short, man. A lot of people in the South still rock jean shorts. I ain't gonna cap. I'll go to the store and I go places every blue moon and I still see. It don't even be older heads. It just be folk rocking jean shorts. And most of the time I see them in, like, the distressed and the, like, you know what I'm saying, bleached out look like that. Um, another thing I was going to say, like I said, I be having these thoughts when I'm riding home, so I said I, when I get back, I'm going to do the outro and I'm going to talk about some of this stuff. Is I When I was showing those Air Jordan amalgamation mixed gumbo trash can nothings, you feel me? When I was showing them, I did say I did like the maroon color on them. If they make a whole Jordan 12, that maroon color, not thinking in my mind that we got our mama near Jordan 12s coming out that's very similar to what I had in mind when I was saying that. So I guess subconsciously I was like, oh, I'm on near 12s, but I wasn't thinking about it at the time. I was just thinking that maroon color might be dope on a 12. And I've been seeing like very recently uh, more images releasing of the, um, even somebody put a video out of some today of the I'm on Manier Jordan 12. It was like a big old stack of boxes and they pulled out when I, sh if I can find a clip, I'll show y'all uh, right here. But, um, those are fire. Those are fire. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if I like the black ones better or the white ones, but the white ones against that maroon do look, do look pretty good. You know what I'm saying? If, if that's maroon, might be like dark burgundy. Y'all know I'm on Manier always using that kind of color. But I think that's it, man. Um, Travis Scott ain't gonna bring jean shorts back. <laughs> we got our mom and there's 12 coming that look 12s are coming that's looking dope. And I saw my Seattle 10s, man. So uh, <laughs> I seen a couple of dope hats in that in the uh, vlog. So y'all comment below anything that y'all like in this video, man. So thank y'all. Like I said, thank y'all for watching. Go ahead and hit the thumbs up. It costs nothing to hit the thumbs up right now if you enjoyed this small little small vlog. Oh, I didn't talk about the main thing that was in the video. And I don't have to talk about that much. Even though this hoodie will go straight stupid. With them, um, true red, varsity red, fire red nines that dropped today. By the time I put this video up, it'll be yesterday. When that shoe dropped, I was like, I would never buy this shoe. <laughs> you feel me? That's the first thing that came to my mind. I know a lot of people probably caught people gonna get that shoe with Christmas gifts, and I think the hood messed with nines pretty much too. Like the hood, the hood man with nines, and the hood man with 12. He ain't talking about. So I'm not opposed to anybody copying that shoe it just ain't for me so don't jump in the comments and be like rich you like a lot of trash too you like jordan 7 you like this and that. i know we all don't agree man to me that shoe would trash but to, i mean i mean and like i said i don't knock nobody who buy it it's just far as my drip and the way i dress and the way i like to rock shoes don't think look like space boots but then again i'm biased because they bring out olive nines and I think, I don't know what the reason I like Olive 9 so much, because that silhouette just kind of remind you of a boot, and the Olive 9 colorway kind of remind you of a boot kind of colorway, you know, especially with the suede and stuff like that. It looks very, very dope, you know what I'm saying? 
Um, but when they try to put all these other colors on nines, I ain't feeling it. All of, give me all of nines, man. That's that's the colorway that goes perfect. Even the beef and broccoli lights on it. Those are the colorways. Those bootish looking colorways go dope on nines. Anyway, that's enough of me talking. I appreciate y'all for watching. Y'all hit that thumbs up, like this video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Hit that little notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up to the moon on them. Hey, Tom, back. <laughs> Keep watching my video, cause that's what I'm here for. Gone. Call up the plug, hit me a lick. Early hits from Retro Rick. New air bubble like helium lift. So as the bless, thank God for the gift. Yeah, yeah, it's a hit. Premium fit. No barbecue, but this is it. Hold up, rock, rock, just might hit. With riches, kick. I mean, my rich. Yeah, ballin' all the way to the moon on them. Space Jam going on the tune on them. Sweeping y'all haters, get the broom on them. New heat coming real soon on them. Yeah, my rich fans shouted, that's what I got to give for. Thank you for watching these vids, that's what I'm here for. It gone all the way up to the moon on them. What's happening to everybody? Yeah. Life so lighty daddy Bless. Hit that Nike store just like your girl hit Hobby Lobby Then yeah. we fly to Abu Dhabi, then we gone Straight up to the moon on them